I'll see you around. And remember, we're samurai. We thrive, not because we win. Actually, like but because we always get back up. I mean, honestly, honestly, I do think that Carlos fucked up big time. You know, like what he did on Twitter. But it's also true that he made G2 happen. And it's also true that, you know, he did in a way create the most winning, the most dominant team we had in Europe for the past couple of years, excluding some of them like last year. <laughs> okay, excluding last year, okay? Like last year didn't happen and, you know, but excluding last year and maybe 2018, he did make a really fucking insane team and G2 didn't exist eight years ago. And right now it's like one of the most known brands when it comes to esports across multiple titles, not only League of Legends. Well, they kind of got canceled in Valorant now. Um, be also because of, you know. But this is really crazy. Paid, Perks made G2 happen. Yeah, I mean, Perks also was a big factor why G2 was successful. Of course, he was a great player. So it's definitely, um, it's interesting. It's interesting to me how G2 will, you know, live on, I suppose. And it's also a question, who is the new CEO? I mean, we already have like a pretty experienced jungler who is handsome, would definitely talk to sponsors very well and is very trustworthy and does not leak anything ever. So you can trust him with every secret. But yeah, it is definitely interesting. Interesting what's gonna happen. I mean, I wasn't like that close with Carlos, even though I played in G2 forever, but he was very, very fucking supportive of like, like he was always like, I don't really have like bad things to say about him either, you know, because he was really, I know he like fucked up big time and I did disagree with like what he said and did on Twitter, but he really was supportive of like League of Legends, you know? Like, he was really, really good to league players. Actually, uh, when you were competing, let's say. Let's say when you were competing. When you were in his team and you were competing, he was very supportive. When it comes to some other things, I know he, like... Actually, yeah. I mean, he did fuck up a lot of things, actually, in the past. Yeah, it's true. I mean, yeah, when I think about it, he did, like, he did kind of, like, he did some bad things as well. But yeah, anyway, um, I mean, he, he did make G2, right? Let's just talk about that. And maybe he'll make a comeback. I mean, I don't really know. Because doesn't, like, he was, um, um, like, Frozen for eight months? How do you call it? Yeah, thank you. Not frozen, but like he was um, suspended, right? For eight months? Yeah. Uh, eight weeks, sorry. Say, eight weeks. Say, really but does it mean he left completely now or what? I, I really don't know. Like, this is the first time. Wait, may, maybe I should check tweet, like my phone. Maybe like I got a message from someone. I'm not really, I guess. Anyways, what we do is we keep competing. We keep competing and we keep winning. That's the plan, right? We have worlds to win.